Hey tribe and welcome back to my first video of the year. My guest is getting a pixie cut and colour. This was a really big chop for her so what I started to do was cut the excess hair off. We don't need it so we're going to take it off. And I want to note here that my client has really fine hair. She's got good density but she's got really fine hair and before we do any sort of color the first thing of business the first thing of business the first order of business is having a consultation and making sure that my clients are well prepped for a color have got a good routine and are willing to look after their hair because there's no point of doing any of this if you're not going to look after your hair because three months down the line you're probably not going to have any hair left so i start off by applying my blonde me bleach on her ends first i leave that on for about 20 about 15 minutes actually and then i then go in at the roots i do this twice and then we end up with this beautiful very yellow finish and this is not the end this is not how you should be walking the streets once it's a pure yellow like this it means it's a clean canvas for having a toner and i think we went for an ice a resay. I know I'm not saying that right, but I absolutely love the blonde me toners because they just get the job done. She wanted something that suited her skin tone, so I felt that this color was a perfect color to do. I applied it all over the hair and I left it on for 20 minutes. I did I do think I repeated this twice because I wanted the color to intensify and I wanted to make sure that sis was not gonna have her hair fade quickly and i do this a lot with my blonde clients i want them to have a long lasting color so one of the things i do is i put the color on twice for about 20 minutes first and then 10 minutes after once it's taken off i just love the way this color came out it had a sandy tone but it also had a pinky undertone in there some parts of the hair picked up the pink undertone and it just really suited her skin and that's what i was looking for i'm all about blondes that suit the skin so her curls have loosened up but they will come back after a few weeks this always happens with bleach clients by this point she's really feeling herself i added the affirm style foam wrap and I also added a little bit of the Super Skinny and the Foamy Pomade by Paul Mitchell. I just really wanted to eliminate as much humidity as possible. And I feel like the Foamy Pomade adds a nice weight to the hair, but not too much that, so that it's greasy. I added then a little bit of the Light Hairdress Cream and sprayed a little heat protection as well. So I'm straightening it out with my tongs, my straighteners. Um, I think the 0.5 um, width and I'm just tapping the roots and giving it sort of like a little bounce. I am going to get rid of that little bit at the back because, you know, I love a neat um, pixie cut. This is the end result. She was kind enough to send me um, selfies that she took over the weekend and she looked absolutely fabulous. Can you guys catch that pink undertone that I'm talking about? Okay, thanks for watching. I'll see you next time. Okay, bye.